Hi. 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 What's up? What are we talking about again? Icebreaker! Yay! Tech Tea Light. So we're big fans of Icebreaker. Disclaimer, we've actually done work for them, some marketing materials and videos. Yes. But we love their product and... I was a customer long before I ever met anybody from Icebreaker. I discovered them about, well, when the Touch Lab opened up across from Powell's. Yeah, in downtown Portland, there's a Touch Lab, which is what they call their retail stores. I, yeah, I went in there first and a little turned off by the high prices. Oh yeah, very expensive. But then one day at REI, I found a t-shirt there that was on closeout. So I was like, yeah, I wanted to get a wool shirt and right. see how it is. And I fell in love with it. It's, it's a wool shirt, but it's not typical wool. It's merino wool, which is a special kind of sheep. This is the long sleeve version of the Tech Tea Light. And I am wearing the short sleeve version of the Tech Tea Light. I've had this one about two years. And I've had this one about two weeks. What do you think so far? I love it. I have to say, one of the key features of, of merino wool in general is that it doesn't hold odor. And I was sort of skeptical of that, but like so far it's actually been, I mean, obviously if I spill something on it, I can't wear it again, but like it's, you know, I'm wearing it to work, so I'm not doing like crazy hard workouts and stuff, but I've been able to wear it multiple times and I've only washed it like once. I have done like worn it for like workouts and like mm -hmm. hiking and that sort of stuff. Mm -hmm. And it'll, it will pick up that odor, but all you got to do is just air it out for a little bit. Oh, really? Oh, just nice. air it out and the yeah. smell will be gone and you can keep wearing it. Speaking of that, like when you do have to wash it, um, you can machine wash it, but you can't um, put it in the dryer, but um, it dry, you like air dry it and it dries so fast. The other day I needed it for a party and it literally dried in like four and a half or five hours. It was totally dry. Yeah, in just like normal, like in your house? Yeah, it was literally draped over my computer chair. And I think it's better like not, not having to have the energy to dry your clothes with, with an electric dryer. The clothes don't break down as quickly. Yeah, it, it causes less damage to the clothes. Although my first tech tea has taken quite a beating. Really? <laughs> yeah. Do you have it? I do still have wow, it. Wow, I want to see it. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Awesome. So it's still mostly a shirt. Yeah. What's wrong but with it? There's some little zip, uh, zip oh. tears. <laughs> Oops. Some stains that yeah. haven't been able to come out. Some oh my God. <laughs> in, <laughs> in the armpits. Awesome. So wow. this is not typical of like normal wear and tear, I would say. This is like, okay. I wore this like hardcore for the first few months that I had it. And then- Oh wow, okay. Um, like every day. I, yeah, I got a couple, two or three more a few months after and uh, starting to rotate them, but still like, Two or three times a week. So it's not, it's it's sort of like not typical wool because it's not itchy at all and it's not um, heavy at all. Like it doesn't, it, it's not hot. It feels like, it. it feels like a normal t-shirt, mm -hmm. but it doesn't have that clingy feeling of polyester. And it's almost like we're total shills for this product. We do. It's like, it is so awesome. It it's is. Like, they're not paying us for this at exactly. all. Exactly. They're, they're not asking us to do this. Like I was saying about uh, polyester, like polyester clings to you. Mm -hmm. It dries fast, but like there's a, that time before it dries that it's clingy and it just doesn't feel right. Right. And cotton will absorb all that water, all, all your sweat and everything. And so then it weighs like five times yeah, as much. Yeah, it hangs onto it and so it's it just kind of gets all clingy and stuffy. But this just, it's like the best of both worlds. Yeah, exactly. It sucks the moisture out of it, wicks it away. Yeah, but it does it in a natural way instead of in an artificial polyester way. Right. And so it feels, it just feels a lot better. And it's better for the environment. Yeah. It comes from a renewable resource. No growing it, just growing the grass for the sheep to eat. Because, you know, Mother Nature designed sheep well, apparently. Yeah, no, less wear and tear, and, and like I said, it's so comfortable to wear. Like, I find myself at work, I'll be like sitting in a meeting, I'll just be going like touching this, yourself. touching myself, and like, that's kind of weird. My, my, uh, my coworker looked over, she's like, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm so soft. That's great. And I'm looking forward to some new products. Like, I, I've heard rumors of pants. Yes. Jean style pants. Yes. Made of wool. Yes which would be completely awesome. Yeah, it would be. And I have three more items of clothing coming that I'm so excited because the tech tee right now is all I have. What else did you get? I got um, like a hoodie and I got like a zipper kind of soft shell and then I got another tech tee. So anywho, if you have experience with wool shirts, either Icebreaker or even Smart Wool, that's the other big brand. Nice. Let us know what you think about them and leave a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Yeah, we'll be around. Bye. And you don't have soft. And because you don't have to wash them as much, they they'll last longer too. <laughs> wow, that was lovely. Thanks. Yeah. Thanks for listening to that. <laughs>